previously on. Wanna be clear. I will do you no wrong. When the time comes, it'll be my life for yours. I'll agree to get white. Johnny. Tags are proof of my promise. Johnny. I I do the same for you. One more time. I'm just gonna talk to Rogue about Smasher, right? Then you'll hand me the wheel, hop back in the passenger seat. That is the plan. Don't worry. I'll be gentle. You might even enjoy it. Hello, Night City. Woo, shit. I survived a night of... Drinking, smoking, stripper chasing, like... What the fuck? The hell is this place? A place where you can puke all over the carpet, no problem. Beggar, not chooser. Whatever, bro. I'm just glad that I'm alive, honestly. Which reminds me... Let me check to see exactly what job I can do. Talk to Nyx. Let me see here. Yeah, I'm just in this random ass place. I love it. I really do. Um, so he's around here somewhere from what I'm seeing? Perfect. Let me force this open. Alright, so I'm going to go and talk to Nyx and let's catch a ride. Okay, okay. Alright, so... What, he's downstairs or some shit? Let me see here. Oh, he's at the club. Okay. Okay, so... Yep, he's at the club. I think I know exactly who it is. I did reject him earlier since I thought the job was a little bit suspicious and wow this is awesome I just love how cyberpunk takes a million years to even load details simple ass details no I'm good Claire I'm not touching alcohol for the rest of my life bro ah so next V dog listen Got a yarn for you. Quick biz, that is. You interested? All right, lay it on me. I was cruising the net, you feel? And I spotted an interesting classified. Wait, let me guess. Performance enhancers? Why Use am I talking in a cheap. male voice? Now, I'm a serious man, V. And serious matters are what, if not all, that concern me. Somebody's selling a book of spells. Edition dating from before the first net crash. Now, you know a thing or two about that, don't you? Like, how much that soft could run you, and earn you. You want me to clep it for you, don't you? Why am I talking uh, like this? No clepping required. Just buy the damn thing. Reimburse you twofold. Sending me out to do your shopping? Want a case of Nicola with that? Algae chips? Think on it, V. A treasure, and someone's willing to part with it. Now who does that? The hard up, V. And Desperado's got this unsavory side. They're unpredictable. One word off their mood, and they reach for their heat. That's why I need you to meet the seller. You got heat at the ready. Okay, we'll do. Yeah, my man. Zipping you the deets on the seller. And luck be with you all the way. Um, first of all, why was I talking in a male voice? Hey, got a job for you, swing by when you have sex. Nyx has shared a contact with you. R E N O. Got it, thanks. Clear enough. Agreed. Clean. I flipped you the address. Come by 
Slayer wants him. R E N O send me coordinates. Come alone. I have eyes everywhere. No problem. I just love how, even though I was playing as a female character, suddenly my balls dropped and I had a, a deep ass voice throughout the whole interaction with the guy. Like, what the fuck, Cyberpunk? This is why. CD Projekt Red has mad lawsuits because of bullshit like that. Alright, so this person wants money. Do I have enough? Let me see. No, 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 no. I have 4,000 chips. I have 4,000 chips. Do you think it's enough? I hope that person's only asking for 3,000 chips. Because this would be a pain in the ass for me to complete this particular mission because of the fact that I am poor. But you know what? Let's see what happens. Alright! we I am here! And I am queer. Anyways. Alright, she better accept these little chips, because if not, then... I love how you- I love the way you just sat, by the way. Oh, oh, now I see the details. And this little bar in front of my screen, I don't know if you guys see it, but I see it, and it's just annoying me to no end. Oh, hello. I see you. Thank you. Uh, Thank you for yeah. texting me. Spellbook. You got it? I do indeed. Tucked away somewhere safe. Okay. You want coordinates? I need to see my money. How much are we talking? Oh. F shit. You trying to fuck me? No, not at all. I just... Because I really got it in for people who try that. Always tempted to end any conversation like that. Violently. Abruptly. You'd be making a mistake. A big one. I'm not out to con you. Also, I'm not a victim. Mm -hmm. I'm prepared just as well as you are. Mm -hmm. Not about to do any biz with a petty con. And you do good to avoid me all the time. Everywhere. Mm-hmm. Dude, um, okay, so she's asking for 7,000. Ah, uh, damn. Should I steal the data? What the hell is this? Yeah, I'm gonna steal it. Because I'm not about to, like, pay mad shit for it. Sorry. Here. Damn it. Uh, oh shit. Oh nice. Yay. Nice. Oh Lord have mercy. It's like that, eh? Mistake. Eh? She's dead. <laughs> Okay, so... Nice. Nice, I love this. And, uh, I'm gonna use this and steal all the data. Cause I know for a fact I'm not paying that much money, so... Mr. Stud. Oh <sighs> this Don't is crazy! Stop. Wow, Lurley has everyone on camera. Let me see, am I... do I have to... Okay. Alright, let me just... hold on. So I gotta steal the data from the computer. I like how no one is doing anything either. 
got it. Clarity during inventory of the Club Street Warehouse, they found equipment from the 2020s. No one has any idea how it came to company possession. There's no accompanying documentation. Pretty weird, right? Scan and copy these discs, then destroy the originals. And I expect discretion. You could stumble into something valuable in here. Holy Fry, Director of Technology, Hardwire, LTD. Holly, I scanned the disk, but unfortunately the data were completely corrupted. I've ordered to have them destroyed per your quest. Regards, Clarity. Cool. Alright, I gotta collect the goods from the stash now. I am so sorry y'all had to see this, but... I wasn't really gonna pay her seven grand because my poor ass did not have the seven grand. Alright, let's go. Let me see where these goods are at. Are you serious? They're over here the whole time? Oh, lord. They were down here. Okay, let me get out. Let me get out. Anyways. Got it. Uh, what's this? Looks like trash. Oh, the Zeta Tech XPR. Top of the line back in the day. Really? Well, I'm gonna return to Nick because this guy owes me money. I'm not gonna read. Because it's not my business to read, honestly. Anyways. Remember to take only certified enhancing supplements. Alright, let me go and return to Nyx, because he definitely needs to... He definitely owes me. Now, let me see here... Ah, right here. First of all, I hate this. Hold on. Alright, so I assume that white line would be... Wow, I totally crashed. Yeah, whatever. Move out the way. Damn. Anyways, I assume that white line is the pathway to the club, so I'm going to follow this pathway. And wish me luck. What the hell did I- I literally... So I drove all the way over here for nothing. I thought this was the way to the club! Come on! Let me check my map one more time. You know, this is really annoying because it's like... I know it's just optional for me to decrypt the Book of Spells, but I don't want to. So why am I not able to go to Nick straight? Through. Like, this is a pain in the ass. It really is. I just don't understand. Wow, so I can't even return to the club at all. Like, fuck this mission, am I right? Oh, hold on, let me just. Alright, so I finally. Holy shit, whatever. So I finally managed to find exactly his location, and that is a very annoying bug, Cyberpunk. It's like, Cyberpunk, what's- you really making me not want to play with you anymore, but I was looking forward to playing this game for years, years, and now that I finally got the game, I don't even enjoy it anymore because of the amount of bugs and glitches that I'm experiencing almost every single episode. I see it. Everyone else sees it on my channel. Like, I even got some people telling me that they're surprised that I'm actually playing Cyberpunk. Regardless of the issues that are coming along with this specific game. 
Like, this shit sucks, bro. It really does. Alright. Once I give him the book, that's it. I'm just done with this mission altogether. What's it like, working for Rogue? It's fine. That's mm -hmm. it? Fine? You want info on Rogue? Ask her yourself. I'm sure she'll be ever so obliged. Listen, from one netrunner to another. Got any pro tips you could spare? <laughs> Don't see why not. If you're cool with Rogue, you're cool with me. Nice. I can sell you a few tricks of the trade from the Bart Moss era. Reach Bart Moss. The Bart Moss. Tell me you're not fucking with me. Before dropping off the grid, he unleashed a slew of ice-breaking grams and protos in the darkest corners of the net. Heard how paranoid he was. Any idea what happened to him? <sighs> Who knows? But I was able to dig up a few classic Bart Moss relics. Here, let me show you. Ew, I have to pay for it. I forgot. Sorry, I'm too poor. So, you got the book? You got my Eddie's? As I says, B, I am a serious man. Amount is agreed. All yours. How much? Thanks a bunch. Don't mention it. Ooh, 11. It's money well deserved. You have received a transfer from Nyx. Nice. I love this. Just remember that you have friends that you have me. Let me know how things are going with you. I hope you're getting somewhere with that biochip thing. Hey, things aren't easy, but I'm getting by. Thanks for asking. Starting to run out of time, which means less chance of getting through this. Listen, Saul and I have been thinking about how to get this feeling back on its feet. We have a plan. But the most important thing is that we might be able to help you. What kind of plan? Trust me. Okay. If everything goes according to plan, then, well, let's just say the train heist has got nothing on this. Huh, that's cute. <laughs> hmm. Alright, so I noticed that there is this mission where supposedly my old car from the beginning of the game has been found. So I'm just going through all my notifications on the phone and let me see here. I did notice that I saw a text from Judy, so. Let me just take a look here. And, um. Let me see. Judy. How you doing, V? Find those voodoo boys yet? Sure did. Hope you found what you were looking for. It was pretty interesting. Helped them out a little. Helped them expand their turf. Had a little run in with Netwatch. Took a trip down cyberspace lane and met an AI. You know, same old, same old. Uh, sure, alright. <laughs> Take care of yourself, okay? I don't want you to end up like Eve. Oh, shit. What about Evelyn? Any improvement? No changes? She's trapped deep in her brain somewhere. Must be going through hell. Sorry, gotta run. See you. Bendito. That really sucks. Alright, let me see. Bart Moss Collective. Let me check here. What's this? Is this some type of spam? First will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. Whenever money changes hands, your true self becomes a victim to capitalism. The best weapon against capitalism is uninterrupted meditation. 
Oh my god, I can't believe even in this game I get spam bots to my phone. Like, how is that possible? Corporate oppression will only end once you stop oppressing yourself. Wake up and wake others up. Join collective. Oh, whatever. Wait, a new job? Killing in the name? Huh. Check the notifications and phone. No, I just. I'm not gonna get distracted, okay? I'm not. Let me see here. Let me see here. Thor. Wait, this is it. Activating geolocation services. GPS enabled. Coordinates transfer to user. How, how is that even possible? All wheels are up and running. Huh. Well, I guess it's time to find my car. So this is where it's at, huh? And the city dumps. Damn. If the dumps ever really look like this in real life, I could see why the earth is dying, honestly. I would be so surprised if my very first car is still in working condition. There's no way in hell it's still working. Not if it's been in the dumps for like, how long? Okay... Ooh, what's this? Avi, I have some new work for you. A certain item needs to be salvaged from the landfill before some gonks chop it to pieces. I've attached some more details for you. Cool. I'll just get to that later. Right now, <sighs> I just wanna... Been a damned long while, old friend. What am I looking Let's at? Let's see what we got here. No, really, what am I looking at here? Is this another glitch I'm, ex I'm experiencing? Or scan your old car. Look under the hood. I am so done with cyberpunk. Like, bro. Nah. Okay, so... Um... My car is supposed to be here. This is what the map is telling me, right? And yet, all I see is nothing. I'm scanning, and obviously there's nothing to scan, because again, this game wants to fucking glitch. Like, I just love it. I really- body disposal, oh lord. I love it. Truly, honestly, I just love it. Oh lord, this... this is horrible. Look under the hood! HOW?! There is no hood! There is no car! What am I looking at? You see, this is what I've been talking about. Cyberpunk, you... have truly... disappoint me. Time and time again. Like, I'm surprised that my viewers actually watch this video, this this gameplay, because, well, you know what, maybe that's why they watch the gameplay, just to see these types of glitchy messes and then make fun of it. Because in all reality, Cyberpunk, you would never be taken seriously. Never. You have potential. You had a good amount of hope and now hope is basically gone and replaced by a pile of shit a big fat steamy pile of shit that gets sued over and over again how am i supposed to do this mission when said mission is glitching
from who? Who the hell is that? Are you kidding me? Who the hell is shooting me? I literally shot air. Uh. Then again, who doesn't want to fight, right? Oh, hell no. I am great. I'm good. I don't even want to do anything. Like... Ah, oh, Lord, have mercy. You know what? I'm just gonna drive away. I'm not really in the mood to hit anything. Drop or your weapon. Hit drop anyone. Me. You can drop these cheeks! Because I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm good. Goodbye. Thank you so much for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.